Hi and welcome everyone to Nikki Loves Books. Nikki here and today we do have our Owl Cray Young Adult Box for August 2023. So let's go ahead and open it up. The theme for our Young Adult August 2023 Owl Cray Box is Through the Seasons. So right off the bat we're going to open the item that I was most excited for and that is the Story Doorways. So it says... For those who constantly cross over the threshold into fictional worlds, we've created a collection of stunning wooden doorways inspired by the stories that you love to lose yourself in. Display them on your bookcases in front of spines or book stacks or use them as a bookend for bookshelves that you've not managed to fill with books just yet. We're entering through the wardrobe and embarking on an adventure to the magical land of Narnia. This Chronicles of Narnia story doorway is designed by Ice Wreath. And here is our Narnia doorway, Courage Dear Heart. Enter a new fantastical world with our new story doorway, designed with love by Ice Wreath. This item is inspired by the Chronicles of Narnia. Travel far and wide and display them on your shelves in front of your book spines or stacks or as a bookend to hold the many other stories you love to wander through. Next up, we have a box. Just this owl crate on it. On the back, immerse yourself with the magical quartz in the realm of the fairy with this A Court of Thorns and Roses inspired tin. You can store your little fairy items or hide your most secret trinkets within them. The tin features stunning artwork representing each of the seven quartz in Perithian. I'm so excited we got to open this right away. So here is our beautiful Actar 10. Night Court, of course, at the top. Our next item is sure to bring you closer to the land of the fairy. Our a Court of Thorns and Roses inspired tin is beautifully designed and features art depicting each of the seven courts in the series. Next we have this item which I'm not quite sure what it is. So it is done by Fiction Bathco which I love that company. And it says Brook, Bergamont, and Autumn Woods. Not sure if this is like a chapstick or something. Let's, let's find out. Fiction Bath Co. brings the autumn season to life with this solid perfume inspired by an enchantment of ravens. Haven't read yet on my to read list. It is vegan and holds scents of bergamot and autumn woods. Wear this before a walk through the fall forest or on a cozy day of reading. And I did find out this is not a pull off. This is a twist off. It does smell really, really good. Not gonna lie. I generally don't wear perfumes, but I'm gonna be rocking this because I like it a lot. Autumn does happen to be my favorite season and I do love all the scents of autumn. So that could be why I like it so much, but I think this is great. Next up we have this, which we're gonna read the quote first. It says, this is what you must remember. The ending of one story is just the beginning of another. And on the back side, it says winter, spring, summer, fall, death is the fifth and master of all. I don't know where those quotes are from, but I like them. And on the inside, tabs. And it looks like one of mine might have fallen off prior to me getting it because I opened it and there was a blank slot and I can't find any of these tabs in my box. So I think it fell off before packing. But these are tabs for when you're reading and you can mark your pages without destroying your book. I love these tabs. For the dedicated annotator, this item is sure to elevate your reading experience. Our annotation kit allows for annotating your favorite quotes without having to highlight in the book. Inspired by the fifth season, this item was designed by Riddle and Ravens and Teresa Chen. The fifth season, I do not recognize. I don't know if it's on my to be read list, but it might be soon. Last but not least of our bookish merch items before we get to the book, of course, is our treasure tomes. And it says here, this one is 8 out of 12 and it's Emily Wilde's Encyclopedia of Fairies. And here is our darling enamel pin treasure tome. It opens. There are those details. I love these for the fact that they're books and they're highly detailed. This month features the 8th Treasure Tomes enamel pin in our 2023 pin collection. 
Each month's box will include a book styled pin featuring in-universe references to many beloved books and fandoms, all designed by at no one designs. Peek into the dedicated research of Emily Wilde encyclopedia of fairies and enter the world of fairies if you can find them. All right, and that was the last bookish item we had today before, of course, our book. And for me this month, my favorite item has got to be the story doorway. I'm really liking being able to decorate my bookshelf without taking away room from books for the most part. So I really like the bookish doorways. I would love to hear if you had a favorite item for this box this month. Let me know in the comments. Before we get on to the main event, let's go ahead and go through our newsletter this month. First part of the newsletter always features a small interview with the author of the book for the month, so we're going to skip that for now. They also include a picture reference of the difference between the Owl Crate exclusive cover and the regular cover, which we'll be going over after I reveal the book. Next up, we have news from the Nest, which is Owl Crate's social media community. Then they usually feature an interview with one of the vendors of the month, and they did Fiction Bathco, who did our autumn scented perfume. Then they have information about the photo challenge if you wish to do that. And then they also have information about the Owl Babel and then also the Spotify playlist. Other than the Spotify playlist, my favorite part of the newsletter is seeing what other books are excited about for this month. So those include, and I'm probably going to butcher this, but House of Marion, Bring Me Your Midnight, The Radiant Curse, Zahara, and Never a Hero. So that is it for our newsletter. Let's move on to the book. And our book this month is Omen of Ice. It's a very winter feeling book. August's book selection enters into the world of the Fae where no one is as they seem. In Omen of Ice, our main character, Keltania, has trained to be a bodyguard for a winter Fae. Things take a turn when her assignment is the heir to the throne. She is determined to keep him safe even if he doesn't want it, especially when their lives and their hearts are at stake. Our signed edition features pastel blue sprayed edges and a gorgeous redesigned exclusive cover by at Cover Dungeon Rabbit. And here is that difference between the regular cover and the Owl Crate exclusive. I think the regular cover is kind of badass. Looks like it has a much darker theme than the Owl Crate exclusive. I think they're both pretty. I just like more of the gothic look of the regular cover, but of course I'm very happy to have my Owl Crate exclusive. Turn over the dusk jacket to reveal a stunning scene. The hardcover foils feature gorgeous art done by Jade Cunningham. Inside you'll find beautiful end page artwork. Finally, an author letter is bound to the book along with some bonus content for our subscribers. And that is it for our exclusive Owl Crate edition of Omen of Ice. I'm really looking forward to this because obviously romance. I'm a little sad that it's kind of a winter scenery book and it's summer where I'm at still. Um, but I'll get over that. I'll be reading this as soon as I'm done with these Bitter Blooms, which was the book that I got from my most recent bookish box. So yes, I will be reading this as soon as I'm done with these Bitter Blooms. I just wish that I could summon winter at the same time. So before we leave, we need to find out what the theme is for next month. The theme for our next Owl Crate box is Drown Your Secrets. And the sneak peek is every September box will include an exclusive tea handmade by Riddle's Tea Shop. I love that company. They make excellent tea. Highly recommend it. So looking forward to that. So that is it, everyone, for our Through the Seasons Owl Cray August 2023 Young Adult Box. If you want to see me do more unboxings, please be sure to hit that like button. Make sure you're subscribed so you can join me for all the bookish fun. Thanks so much, everyone.